Okay, my um, next tip is Windows Movie Maker Part 2. Um, in this one I'm basically going to add some titles, some credits, um, maybe some overlays, and then add some audio um, to the scene. Alright, so basically I, I've grabbed down here several clips from a little presentation that some folks did. And what I want to do is add some titles. So what is going to make it easier is I, if I go to sh my storyboard um, and I'm going to do over here to, so we've got our collections, I want to go to um, tools, titles and credits. I want to add a title at the beginning of the movie and I'm going to say My Friends Playing Music by Robert Griffith. Okay, and I, I'm going to do, right here it shows you with the preview what it's going to look like. It's kind of boring. I'm going to change the title animation, and I'm in two lines here, so, you know, we've got some different things to play with. That one's kind of cool. So I think because for time I'm just going to stay with that one. I'm going to change the text and font color, so my color of my text maybe is going to be this silver color. Wow, it's a little bit hard to read. Maybe if I do my text as black. Or maybe I'll swap this and make the background black and the text silver. That's pretty cool. Alright, so you can set your transparency. You can set your size. Alright, and I'm going to go ahead and do done. And You'll see what it does is it adds the, the title in there. So now if I start pushing play here, you'll see that it's a nice little title in my movie. And it jumps right into the music. And I'm going to go back in here and to Tools, Titles, and Credits, and I'm going to say Credits at the End. And I'm going to say, um, thank you for watching. Um, music. Um, John Smith. Video. Robert Griffith, you know, like that. And I'm going to just go ahead and say done. And I'm going to click back here and push play. So you can see it's pretty easy to add these things. Now, the next thing I want to do here, I'm going to go back to my timeline. And up here on my movie, all right, I can go and let's see here. I'm going to go and add on different music, and I'll start that at the beginning. Now when I push play, okay, so you can see how my music that I put on is getting washed out by this extra music. Okay, so what I want to do here um, is adjust my music a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and play this. Go to Tools, Audio Levels, and I'm going to drag this over to my audio music and away from the video. Okay, so you can see now that this area down here is all silent, but this has got music back. Okay, so we have our basic movie. Um, but I want to add some other effects, too, and, and some other titles. I'm going to go to Tools, Title, and Credits, and I'm going to say add a title on the selected clip. All right, so I'm going to go on the selected clip here, and I'm going to say John Smith on drums. Um, and I think that's good. But the title animation I'm going to change so that you know, maybe I can have something that would be nice to have over the top of it, but maybe not so intrusive. So there's typewriter, and that's kind of ugly. News banner, that looks pretty good. And I'm going to change the text and color. Maybe my background's going to be um, purple, and the text can be uh, gold or orange. Okay, so I've got that, and I do done, add the title, and you'll see that it adds it down here. Well, I want to drag it over here, 
And you'll notice that I have this on a different layer. If I put it on the same layer, I, which I could, it would just make it another video clip on its own. But what this is going to do now... And now another thing that's neat is if I click this, I can actually drag this to extend it. So now if I go in here... Alright, so you can get some really good effects this way. Um, you know, it's not going to make you Hollywood movies, but Windows Movie Maker is good, it's free. Um, it On my computer it crashes a lot, but you know, again, it's free. I'll do some Premiere tutorials and stuff later and you can see some of the differences. So I hope this works and enjoy.